music ever since I first heard Hendrix and the Beatles, so I was about 14 when Hendrix died, and I guess that's when I got my first guitar. It was a Mustang. I wanted a Strat, but I could only afford a Mustang. I had gradually learned by fiddling around with guitars that I could afford, I'd learned how to repair them, adjust them, modify them. And so at some point when I met a friend who could wind his own pickups, after winding a couple on his machine, I went down a sewing machine motor and a foot pedal and variac and made my first winder. The first many years I was doing this, I was really just repairing old ones. I was, I don't know, in my 30s before I really started making new pickups. slowly out of just strats first, and two years later, tellies, and as this company grew, I could reinvest more and more money and own more tools. The whole, the whole process of kind of transitioning from being a full-time musician and part-time pickup maker, it took years. I started playing less and less band jobs, realizing how little money we were making, living in poverty with roommates. And <laughs> but then when I got married, I had to really make it a, a serious business and put all my time into it. So, Playing band jobs became a weekend hobby at that point, and all my energies and reinvestment money goes back into this business now. People looking around my room see you know, walls and guitars. Sometimes they ask me, why do I collect lunch boxes? And the truth is, I didn't. I just found them at thrift stores and bought them for the thermos. And I, I broke that many thermoses over the years. I'm not really a lunchbox collector. When I'm trying to find a new pickup or fill a niche that hasn't been filled, I'm not an engineer, so I have to build a lot of prototypes, always changing just one variable. In terms of wire matters, how tight, turns per layer, the whole magnet structure matters a great deal, the type of wire you use. You just have to keep trying things, because I have never designed a pickup on paper. If you have an idea, try it. For more videos, subscribe to our YouTube channel or click here to visit michaelkellyguitars.com.